Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel where we dive into the science of health and wellness. Today, we're talking about one of the world's most beloved beverages, coffee. Stay tuned to find out the five real reasons you should drink coffee every day. Today we're going to talk about five reasons you should actually drink coffee every single day for your health. Dr. William Lee, a distinguished scientist and doctor, is celebrated for his contributions to the study of angiogenesis and its impact on health and illness. He holds a favorable perspective on coffee and its benefits to health. Coffee is more than just a morning pick-me-up. It's a beverage enjoyed by millions of people around the world for its rich flavor and invigorating effects. But did you know that coffee is packed with health benefits that make it worth drinking every day? Let's dive into science. First reason for slowing aging and longevity. Let's talk about longevity. Research indicates that coffee drinkers tend to live longer. Regular coffee consumption is associated with a lower risk of death from various diseases, including coronary heart disease, stroke, diabetes, and kidney disease. And the first reason is that coffee slows down cellular aging. If you want to actually be in the moment and not speed up your aging, it turns out that coffee can actually do that. There is a bioactive in coffee beans called chlorogenic acid and uh, this has been studied in human subjects drinking coffee one to three cups a day has been of uh, drinking coffee has been shown to slow down the burn rate of your uh, telomeres these are the taps at the end of your dna that burn down like a fuse that reflect how fast you're actually aging it's kind of the clock that gets the timer that gets started uh, from the time you're born and the older you are the, uh, the the fuse starts to shrink drinking coffee slows that process down and all you got to do to get that effect is to drink anywhere from one to three cups of coffee a day i easily meet that uh, level myself one study even found that coffee drinkers had a 20 lower risk of death over a 20-year period so your daily coffee habit might just help you live a longer healthier life second reason it protects stem cells. When it comes to stem cells, Doc posits that specific foods, coffee included, have the potential to stimulate our stem cells. These are the cells capable of regeneration and healing within our body. He proposes that consuming coffee can extend the lifespan of our telomeres. Telomeres are repetitive sequences of nucleotides at each end of a chromosome that safeguard the chromosome from degradation. Second reason that you actually want to drink coffee is that uh, uh, coffee actually protects stem cells in your body. Now, our stem cells live in our bone marrow, and they come out into our bloodstream to repair us from the inside out. Happens all the time. But as we get older, our stem cells are a little bit less vigorous than when we're younger. And, uh, uh, and a lot of things can affect this, including uh, oxidative stress from the environment and just simply aging. And so one of the things that coffee does is it protects, acts as a shield to our stem cells so they can actually keep on working as robustly and vibrantly as possible, regenerating us from the inside out. He holds a favorable perspective on coffee and its health advantages. He states that coffee is rich in chlorogenic acid, an anti-angiogenic bioactive compound. This implies that it operates in the body to restrict the blood supply to tumors, preventing their growth. Third reason. It improves our metabolism. Did you know coffee can help with weight management? The caffeine in coffee boosts your metabolic rate and increases fat burning. This makes it a great companion for your workout routine. Third reason to have coffee every day is that coffee improves our metabolism. Coffee contains something called chlorogenic acid. And chlorogenic acid uh, activates our metabolism. And the way it does it is by stimulating the protection of brown fat. We've got different kinds of fat in our body. There's white fat that's wiggly and jiggly and brown fat that's wafer thin. And one of the things that brown fat can do is uh, get turned on uh, like a space heater. Uh, and when it turns on like a space heater, it's a process called thermogenesis. And coffee turns on thermogenesis. And you know why thermogenesis in brown fat is useful? Because the brown fat will... Uh, uh, be triggered and it'll burn down the harmful white fat, the visceral fat. So good fat fights bad fat and coffee actually makes that happen. So you actually get 
more energy uh, and it increases your metabolism. The other thing it does is actually um, helps you lose body fat and you can actually lose weight uh, that way. And studies have been done to show that drinking up to four cups of coffee a day can actually help you lose body fat. In fact, uh, up to about eight pounds of body fat uh, over about six months or so. Not a huge amount by itself, but every little bit counts, especially when it's actually uh, burning away your harmful white fat. Several studies have shown that caffeine can boost metabolic rate by 3 LN and increase fat burning by up to 10 obese individuals and 29 in lean people. Fourth reason, anti-inflammatory and antioxidants health benefits of coffee. Coffee is one of the biggest sources of antioxidants in the Western diet. These powerful compounds help fight free radicals in the body, reducing oxidative stress and lowering the risk of chronic diseases. Another thing that uh, coffee does is it's anti-inflammatory. So chlorogenic acid in coffee is very anti-inflammatory. We know that inflammation is the root cause for a lot of the diseases of aging. And so coffee, enjoy your cup of joe, actually helps you enjoy the rest of your days longer and better because it actually chills out uh, inflammation as well. Studies have shown that regular coffee consumption is linked to a reduced risk of several types of cancer, including liver and colorectal cancer. This is due to the anti-inflammatory properties of the antioxidants found in coffee. Fifth reason, improves gut health. When it comes to gut health, Doc posits that specific foods, including coffee, can confer beneficial effects. He proposes that coffee can enhance your gut microbiome, which subsequently aids in bolstering the immune system. Additionally, he indicates that coffee and tea can decelerate cellular aging, which might have favorable implications for gut health. Finally, coffee improves gut health. It turns out that uh, when you drink coffee, the coffee uh, chemicals actually get down into your gut and it protects our gut microbiome. It shifts the gut microbiome into a healthier state so you've got better neighborhoods of gut bacteria and as you know better gut health is better overall health because our gut bacteria lower inflammation and the way it does that is by re releasing a metabolite called short chain fatty acids or SCFAs, scfas that actually lower inflammation and guess what drinking coffee helps your gut bacteria make more short chain fatty acids more SCFA. So these are all really great reasons why you would actually want to drink uh, uh, coffee every single day. There you have it. The five real reasons you should drink coffee every day. From fighting disease to boosting brain and heart health, coffee is truly a powerhouse beverage. Remember though, it's all about moderation. Enjoy your coffee, but don't overdo it. Remember that each individual's body responds uniquely to substances, and what is beneficial for one person may not be for another. It's always advisable to consult with a healthcare professional before making any substantial alterations to your diet or lifestyle. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more health tips and science-backed advice. Until next time, stay healthy and enjoy your coffee.